Ice enthusiasts. Today is the windiest day of the whole week, so I said, why don't I go outside and teach them how to do a really crazy toss? Because I'm in color guard and apparently that's what we do is we spin even if it's windy. I had several people send me this toss this week asking me if I could clarify how to do it. And I'm gonna just tell you straight up the way that she does it, I can't figure out. I have overextended my elbow, hit myself in the head, thrown my flag way off into Timbuktu and just generally failed at getting this toss done the way that she releases her hand. And when I say she, I'm talking about Hannah T. Reese on TikTok. She's really awesome. Go follow her if you haven't already. This toss I learned from her. I just can't do it with the hand the way that she does. You're gonna start with your right hand on the tab, your thumb pointed down the pole away from the silk. And it's basically in the same position it would be for a surprise 45 toss. However, you're gonna take it and you're gonna do a neck roll behind your neck just like so. I'm gonna put my right hand basically on my shoulder and I'm just gonna lean forward slightly as I do it. As it comes around my back, I'm gonna catch it in my left hand when the tab is on my right shoulder. Now, the way that Hannah does it, she catches it with her palm up. That really makes for a crazy release point in like this chicken wing position on the left side of your body. That's really difficult. And like I said, I've overextended my elbow doing that. So what I have been doing to achieve this toss is doing a money hand with the left. And then as it comes down, it releases here in the 45 plane correctly exactly the same way. It's gonna basically rotate in the air and you're going to catch it with the silk down slightly on your right side because you're tossing it from the left to the right. So it actually kind of arcs over a little bit. Now it helps also if you use the body that goes underneath this. So whenever you are doing the first portion, as you come around to the left side, you bend your left leg and lunge here to make that release. Then you're gonna lunge to the right to catch on the right side. One thing too you'll notice is if you take your arm when you release and actually try to push it over to the right, you're gonna end up really overshooting your flag but if you think about releasing straight up instead, the flag is naturally gonna go from your left side to your right side. Guys, that's all I've got for you today. If anybody has a better explanation of how to do the release hand with thumbs up, the way that Hannah does it, please shoot me a video or something because seriously, I don't know what's up. I cannot get it to come out of my hand and actually do the toss that she's doing whenever it, my hand is in that direction. If you have any more requests, leave them in the comment section below. We will add them to the list. Please make sure you subscribe to our channel. You can hit the button. I think it's here or maybe here. I don't know where the button is. It's red if you haven't subscribed yet though. And then make sure you share this video with all your friends because Color Guard is so much more fun when you can do it on a team.